Many consider the mode and range, let's say, the two less popular brothers of the mean and median, but if used properly, they complement them rather nicely. The mode is simply the value that occurs most often in a dataset. Let's say we have a dataset that consists of the following numbers. 6, 2, 3, 3, 5, 7. To determine what the mode is, it helps if we order them from lowest to highest as follows. 2, 3, 3, 5, 6, 7. As we can see, the mode is 3, the only value that appears twice in our string. But what if we eliminate one of those 3s? In that case, the string becomes 2, 3, 5, 6, 7. In cases like this one, where there are no repeating values, we say there is no mode. What if instead of eliminating one of the 3s, we add a 7 to the original string, which becomes 2, 3, 3, 5, 6, 7, 7. In this case, there are two modes, 3 and 7, so we call this dataset bimodal, and if there are more than two, the dataset is called multimodal. What about the range? Well, as the name suggests, it represents the difference between the largest and smallest value. In other words, what it tells us about our dataset is how dispersed, distributed, or if you will, scattered it is. For our initial string, we obtain it by subtracting 2 from 7, so the range is 5. Simple enough, right?